to swirl around the nation over a juvenile sexual assault case out of Twin Falls. Now the Twin Falls County prosecutor is trying once again to set the record straight. Grant Loeb's appeared earlier this week on the Meet Selman show in Boise. Jeff Platt has the story. There is not a human being on the planet who can put pressure on me to do anything because nobody is my boss other than the voters of Twin Falls County. Many of those who believe there is a cover-up think the case has been compromised because the boys who were charged aren't American but rather are from the Middle East and are thought to be the children of refugees. Because the parents aren't citizens, does that have any effect on the outcome of this case? Can you request that they uh, uh, are sent out of the country permanently. Loeb's answered the many who had similar questions, saying his chance to assert his opinions on issues of citizenship, refugee status, and deportation is in the voting booth, not in his office. He says his job is to hold people accountable when they break the law in Twin Falls County, which Loeb's adds is being done in this case. He tells me the boys are charged with the harshest crimes possible, given the facts of the case, and that, he says, has nothing to do with their religion or or nationality. I wouldn't charge these three uh, with anything different if they were Jews or if they were Presbyterians or if they were Mormons or Catholics. Now Loeb's can't get too specific about the case because it has been sealed by a judge because all the parties involved are minors. That was Jeff Platt reporting. Rupert police are investigating